friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and More. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. I have some friend mail, some birthday friend mail to share with you guys from my BB Tony over at Creative Chica Halls. Um, if most of you, I'm sure, know Tony and are part of her channel, but in her YouTube family, but if you are not, I will link her down below so you can go over and check her out. She's funny and fabulous and you will love her. Um, so she had told me that she was sending me a package on Thursday. She told me she was sending me a package and that it would be here Tuesday, but it actually came today and I was like, oh my goodness. <laughs> Ironically, I was mailing her out something and, um, the gentleman at the post office that works there said, I have something for you. And I was like, oh, okay. And he brings it out and I was like, oh my goodness. So did not think I was getting it that early. So I didn't have any idea of what it was when he said he had something uh, packaged there. So pleasantly surprised. So first off, I just kind of slid everything. It's like a huge box. It's a huge box. <laughs> I've slid everything out of it without like intentionally looking at stuff because I want to be surprised. But I was looking for the card and it says happy birthday to be. Oh my goodness, look at that gorgeous cake and card. Isn't that beautiful? Y'all know I love the glitter. That is gorgeous. Look at the candles. How it shimmers. It's beautiful. Tony. Now what am I going to do with you? Tony, Tony, Tony. It says, so surprise Kimmy, celebrate, love ya, Tony. It's party time. Happy birthday. Isn't that beautiful? And she put a little birthday cake in there for me. A little slice of cake. <laughs> it's probably the only cake I'll get. <laughs> Tony, you're so sweet. You're so kind. Thank you so much. You did not, did not have to do that. She says, go shopping at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> I can hear her now. Take it and run. <laughs> Thank you, Tony. Thank you so much. And then, all right. Let me see what she put in. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? No way, she found the Barbie masks. Oh my gosh, I love them. That's so funny because the other day I was thinking, you know, it doesn't look like this um, whole COVID thing is going anywhere anytime soon. And my light just got dim. Sorry guys on my, um, my, my little um, light there. But I was thinking, you know, unfortunately it doesn't look like COVID is going anywhere anytime soon. So I was like, I really should get a new mask because um, I only have my uh, cheetah masks that I always wear. And of course, like, you know, like the plain, like disposable ones. And then I have a, um, a Chris two Christmas ones. I have the, the one that I had bought, I think like a Target. And then I have one from um, over from, um, y'all, I just had like a total brain freeze. <laughs> I literally was just talking to her this morning, too. I don't know what's wrong with me. Well, I know what's wrong with me. It's too much on my mind. But, um, Max. Max, <laughs> Max is laying right, literally right here in front of me. He's not leaving my side because I had taken to the vet this morning. I should have did, like, a, uh, a day in the life this morning because it was crazy busy. But, anyways, I took him to the vet to get his, um, rabies shot, his updated rabies shot. And um, they did it for three years, which is wonderful because I don't have to go back and get that done for three years. But um, they also, his breed kind of gets stopped up back there, if you know what I mean. So I had to get that extracted for him. And um, he's much happier now, but he doesn't want to leave my side because when they took him back now, um, with COVID and everything, the technician takes him back. You know, the vet techs, they take him back and then they bring him back to you. So he was not happy about having to leave me. He was not happy about them putting that little, like, rope. I guess they use their own, maybe so they don't have to touch yours. I don't know. I've seen some vets do that. I don't really care for it. But if that's their practice or if it's that individual person or they're worried that the your collar might pop off. I don't know. I really have never asked them. I'll have to ask them that. But anyways, he didn't like having that rope put around his neck. He was growling at the kid, the guy that did it. Um, and he, yeah. He wasn't happy at all, but it is what it is. You know, what do you do? <laughs> but anyways, um, 
anyway, so I have, like I said, I have my cheetah one, I have my Christmas one, and then I have my one from um, Lois over at Life with Lois's. She had gotten me uh, a really cute SpongeBob one for Christmas, you know, a Christmas one. Um, so, anyways, I absolutely love this Tony. I'm so excited. I will be wearing that for sure. I'm so excited. Thank you so much. <laughs> and then she had texted me and told me, Max, do not, not knock that camera over, mister. He's wanting all the attention. He just, y'all are getting attention right now. And he's not liking it. But she texted me and told me that she was sending me the gnome fall hand towels. Thank you so much, Tony, because uh, she asked me to have those. I said, no, look, look how stinking cute they are. And the gray matches my kitchen perfectly. It's just perfect for fall. I love it. And I love that, that like checker, that plaid. I love that um, buffalo check, I guess is what it's called. And then, oh, this is so cute. It says you're the cat's meow. Look at that. It has like glitter in it. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Thank you, Tony. And that's one of my favorite colors. Love it. <laughs> oh, and she put me a very, very pretty headband. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. I love headbands. So cute. So cute. <laughs> Probably should take the tag off, huh? <laughs> but anyways, um, let's see. Oh, she put me some. I don't have this, Tony. Thank you. She put me some pumpkin, little pumpkin decors, and I'll probably um, put it in my three-tier tray and decorate it for fall. I'm like, the fall is the official first day of fall is the 22nd, and I'm like, I'm not going to decorate until like probably that weekend or the weekend before. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, how cute. It's got the truck on it. It says Harvest Wishes. I haven't seen the ones with the little truck. That's so cute. Thank you, Tony. I love it. Love it and love you. Oh, and she also put the mitt in that matches the pot holders that matches the hand towels. So thank you. When I get all my fall stuff out, I will show you guys. I'll do you a little tour and show you guys um, what everything looks like. And then let's see. Oh, she put some craft fabric. And you know what? I have some of that stuffing, that pillow stuffing, so I might just make myself a pillow. Thank you, Tony. I love it. Y'all know, obviously, y'all know I love that print. Love it, love it, love it. Oh, and she's got another headband in here. How cute. I love it. I think this is one that I commented on and told her that I really like that. Let me see. Look, Max is like licking his lips because he thinks it's something for him. You're so silly, Max. I'm going to have to wear this one when I do my Mask Monday video, which I want to do. Today's Saturday. I want to either do it today or tomorrow, of course, because I like to pre-record. So, cute, cute, cute. Very cute. I love it. Oh, and I love this pink one, and I do not have one, and that is a great, great color. It's a solid color. I love that. That's beautiful. I love that look. Um, I guess what they call it, like a baby pink color. Thank you, Tony. And then, oh, she put strawberry shortcake in there. Because I told her as a kid, I absolutely loved strawberry shortcake. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yep, I loved strawberry shortcake. Thank you. And then, oh, look at the key ring. It says BFF. You were supposed to keep the other one. I'll just send it to you. That's so cute. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. That's so cute. And then, oh, yeah, she did show me these too. These are cute stickers. It says dog people are good people. That's true. And look at the dachshund. There's my Maxi. Maxi. Maxi Poo. Yeah, you want to say hi? Come here. Come here. I'm trying to get him to come in my lap. Come here. Come here. Look. I want to say hi. I want to say hi to everybody. Yeah. Oh, I love you, Maxie. Okay, don't knock down my camera again. Sit down. Calm down. Okay, good boy. Good <laughs> baby. And then she put this adorable bag in here. I absolutely love these. These are perfect for going to like Aldi's or anywhere. Just throwing stuff in, going to the beach, wherever. I love it, love it, love it. And it's got the cute little glasses on. How cute. And this one right here. 
looks like my Bobo that I had for 18 years. If y'all watch my channel enough, you'll heard me talk about her. I had her for 18, 18 and a half years. And, um, and then she passed away. Oh my goodness, she did tell me she was sending me these two, and I'm so excited. Oh, bubble wrap around it. Thank you, Tony. I was looking for these, and she found it. She found me the K. Aren't those pretty in that plaid buffalo check? And then she found me the D. Hold on, let me hold it up here. Aren't those pretty? I love it, love it, love it. Thank you, Tony. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Love it. And then she, I think, I want to say she was doing a, um, she was going to use this book for her swapping glue. And she knows I love Winnie the Pooh. I have always loved Winnie the Pooh. And when I got my first car, the first car I ever bought for myself, it was brand new. It was a neon. Y'all remember those cars? It was red, red neon. And on the front, I had a um, tag that said Kim. It might have said Kimberly. I can't remember if it said Kim or Kimberly. And it had Winnie the Pooh on it. And in my car, I had a stuffed Winnie the Pooh, like a big one and a little one that always sat in the back seat. So I love Winnie and Tigger, Christopher Robin, the whole gang. I love the whole gang. And, oh. There's my favorite Belle and the Beast. That's not really a beast. He's not really a beast after all, guys. People, sometimes people that you think are not so nice, actually very nice. You just gotta get to know them. Gotta get to see the real them and the real heart. But thank you, Tony. I appreciate you sending me that. And then, <laughs> this is the it says catitude isn't that cute I love it it's got the glasses on it thank you I had not seen those that's cute and look at my bag she sent me I love it it's so girly and pink and it's got like the little cheetah part with a has a little uh, cat ears on it I love it I love it it's so cute oh my goodness she put stuff in here Tony, this is too much. I already told you that the shipping was too much. I jumped on her and I was like, why did you send that? That's too much. She's like, it's your birthday. So sweet. Oh, oh, these are so cute. Look at the little mini gnomes. I love it. I think I'll put that on my window seal. That's so cute. When I decorate for fall, I think these would be so cute sitting there, kind of spread apart, and then put these in between what do y'all think I'll figure it out like I said I'm going to show you guys and then I seen Tony haul these and I was like oh my gosh these are so cute because I hadn't seen them yet and she sent them to me it's with the blue truck oh hold on hold on this one's this one fell off I'm gonna hold it up just like that look are they cute I love them that's perfect for fall that's so cute I can't wait to decorate I know just where I'm putting these two. Super cute, super cute. Thank you so much, Tony. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You did not have to do all this, but I know how you are. You have a ginormous heart, and you're just one of a kind, and I love you so much, and I'm so thankful that I have this channel and that I've met you and so many others. I'm so blessed. And please go over and check her out. I promise you'll love her. She's so talented. She makes, she makes the most amazing crafts like it doesn't matter what it is whatever Tony touches just is beautiful and she is beautiful inside and out and you will love her and I hope you guys have a safe wonderful blessed rest of your weekend rest of your holiday weekend and Tony thank you so much and I love you guys love you Tony thank you bye